Daryl here from joystickunicorn.com. We got a sneak peek and hands-on demo of some of Toshiba's tablets, ultrabooks, and more, all available for the 2012 holiday season. Welcome to part three. We look at Toshiba Ultrabooks and the new U920T Ultrabook Convertible. Toshiba brought out an interesting line of Ultrabooks this year, and I was impressed here with the Satellite U840W. Now the W is for wide in case you were guessing. I mean, look at this thing. Alex from Toshiba Canada tells us more. It's got a 21 by nine. Um, display. So pretty much this display being wide allows you to do a lot of multitasking, be a lot more productive that way. It also comes with a split screen utility. So with the split screen utility you can have different windows open. It makes it a whole lot easier to actually place these different uh, applications together. It comes with Harman Kardon speakers. It's an ultrabook so it definitely has a solid state drive, uh, 128 gigs. Yeah. And it's a very stylish look. It's got the aluminum finish with the rubberized dual texture to it. and. Um, Tile keyboard with backlit keyboard, so if you're doing any type of work at night, it definitely makes the keys a lot easier and visible. Well, in terms of ports, you've got three USB uh, 3.0 ports. You've got two on this end uh, and one on the other end. You've got HDMI as well available to you. You've got SD as well. Uh, what makes this also great is that this being a notebook that you can take with you on the go, because it's a wide screen, because it's not as high as a typical um, laptop screen would be. If you're on a plane, for example, and somebody in front of you kind of rests, you know, puts a seat back, Always right? happens, yeah. you know, it makes it very tough for you to work. But when you have a screen that is not as high, you don't run into that issue. You can still be pretty productive. I noticed uh, when you held it up there, just how thin, I mean, this is, uh, it's a huge screen, but then when you look at how thin it is, that is really impressive as well. Yes, yes, absolutely. If you're looking for an ultrabook that really makes your movies pop or a machine that helps organize your multitasking, the U840W might just be for you. Alex also shows us Toshiba's Satellite Z930 Ultrabook. It also comes with a third generation Ivy Bridge, it's Windows 8 ready and thin. Due to the magnesium alloy casing, it will stand up to some punishment. As a father of two, I can appreciate this. So this is our Satellite Z930. It's our lightest 13.3 inch notebook. Uh, it weighs approximately 2.5 pounds and just because it's thin, just because it's light does not mean it's fragile. Actually the chassis itself is made out of magnesium. Because the chassis is made out of magnesium, you have to understand magnesium is 13 times stronger than plastic and much stronger than aluminum itself. Uh, the battery life on here is great as well. It's about an 8 hour battery life so you can last the entire day without a charge. Um, pretty much it also has a spill resistant keyboard again if you do end up spilling something on there um, your chances are you can now save your data and shut it down. Oh, I love that. Just because it's thin does not mean that you don't have all the ports you would need on the go. It also has um, your USB 3.0 port as well. In the back it's got two USB 2.0 plus a full HDMI port. We a LAN, yeah. that's right. And um, I believe on this end you've got the solid uh, ESD card slot as well. So you get everything you need uh, to be very productive on the go. Now on to Toshiba's centerpiece for this holiday season, the Satellite U920T Ultrabook Convertible. Toshiba aims to blend the performance of an Ultrabook with the usability of a tablet. Okay, so this is the Satellite U920T. So the Satellite U920T is both an Ultrabook and, as you guessed it, it's also a tablet. Hey, hey look at that! So pretty much, uh, it's one of those products that um, if you are at a desk, you can definitely use it as an Ultrabook. It's got all the performance of an Ultrabook. It's got a Core i5 processor, solid state drive, 128 gig. But if you're on the go as well, and you happen to encounter a situation where you don't have a flat surface to actually work as you would on a traditional, let's say, uh, Ultrabook, for example, you can always take this and convert it into a tablet. So now, there's no situation out there that will keep you from being productive. As an Ultrabook, you got the entire, you got all the performance as an Ultrabook, but that same performance actually continues on as a tablet as well. So the same kind of response time, the same kind of, um, pretty much the same kind of performance you expect to have. In an Ultrabook, you also get that same feel when you're in the tablet mode as well. Okay. Um, what's great about this is that um, it's got Windows 8 as well. 
so it's good to know that uh, you got a Windows 8 operating system on this. Now I noticed uh, not the camera obviously up here and a camera on the back That's as well. Right. So let's say for example you're on tablet mode, you'd like to take a, a picture, you can just slide that up just a little bit and then the actual camera in the back shows up, you can take a quick snapshot. Now the, uh, the screen itself, uh, Gorilla Glass? That's correct, Gorilla Glass, it's 12.5 inches in terms of screen size. Uh, it's an IPS panel as well, so no matter what angle you're looking at, the color still stays really well, really uh, great. It also has something called near field communication. So if you have two devices with near field communication, you can easily uh, transfer data between each other. Oh, great. Now, as for the market audience, who do you have in mind for the user that would really benefit from all features of this? Uh... This is for an individual who is definitely a person who's on the go. Uh, an individual who, who likes using a traditional looking uh, notebook, ultra book, uh, you know, keyboard input and all that stuff. But if they ever encounter a situation where they need to be productive still and they can't really find a flat surface, yeah. then they have the option of using the, the tablet mode and still get some work done. So it's for that individual who's always on the go, who always encounters different situations and who always still wants to be productive. While these Ultrabooks aren't exactly designed with gaming in mind, they are powerful enough for you to enjoy more casual games and display them in vibrant, handy ways. And besides, we all need to give our thumbs a break once in a while, right? But not our eyes. Never our eyes. We had a great time checking out the newest tablets, apps, and Ultrabooks at Toshiba's holiday event this year. Our thanks to Andrew, Alex, and the rest of the Toshiba Canada team. Be sure to check out parts 1 and 2 of our Toshiba holiday event coverage if you haven't already. If you like what you've seen, please subscribe on YouTube, share, and visit us at joystickunicorn.com. We're also on Facebook, and you can follow us on Twitter at joystickunicorn. Joystick Unicorn.